it's important for people to understand how big this operation is. Currently, Ice River Springs purchases about 85% of the PET that people in Ontario put in their blue box every day. As farmers, we understood that if you take care of the land, the land will take care of you. We had the opportunity to purchase a trout farm that had a lot of good quality spring water on it and then over time converted that over to bottling. We decided that we would take all of our farms to organic certification in order to protect the source water from any possible herbicides, pesticides or chemical fertilizers. When we first started bottling we were just doing the 4 litre and 10 litre size and it was very manual. Whatever business we operate, we run it as sustainably as possible. Jamie came up with the concept of making our bottle out of recycled content rather than virgin PET. Initially, when we started looking at using recycled plastics, we were buying it from third parties. What we found is there was a lot of inconsistency between batches and it was creating problems and a lot of waste. So Jamie, my husband, he decided we're going to build our own plant and we'll be able to purchase the bales locally, keeping our carbon footprint low, and that's what we did. We were told by many people that we would never be able to achieve a 100% recycled content bottle. We believe nothing is impossible and if somebody says no to you, it means nothing. You keep working, you work harder until you accomplish what you want to accomplish. We have selected top-of-the-line equipment and processes to ensure that we can recycle that beverage bottle over and over again. By repairing the PET molecule back to its original form, we can then stretch it and repair it over and over in an infinite circle. It's a very simple thing to do. You buy a case of water, you put it in your blue box, we do the rest. And you help save this planet. PET plastic has the lowest carbon footprint of other packaging materials, lower than cartons, lower than aluminum cans, lower than glass. We see a high percentage of our bottles come back in the stream every single day. You can go up on the tables and watch the volume of them come through, and they're continually been circulating around for over 11 years now, they've been coming back home. The life cycle of a bottle from a consumer's hands goes into the blue bin, gets collected, goes back to a municipal recycling facility. That facility sorts it into different streams, those materials are all divided out. We take that material, we sort it again, we granulate it, wash it, turn it back into a food grade pellet, we make a preform, we then blow mold, and then that bottle is right on the production line, and it goes back onto a truck and back to the customer again. There's your closed loop the full circle. We are leaders in what we're doing and we're kind of one of a kind right now. We need to get other companies to do this and this is what we're trying to promote. We managed to achieve zero waste to landfill in 2017. All of our facilities make sure that everything we bring in our doors can have a home at the end of its life. We found that we were getting significant amounts of bottle caps on the packaging that was coming into the facility, most of which are HDPE. And we're watching Dragon's Den and we saw this couple that had this company that made this high quality outdoor furniture from recycled HDPE material. So we gave them a call and, and started to supply them with our cap material and ended up buying the company. DMPE is our extrusion plant where we self-manufacture all of our case film for our bottled water now. We are now starting to incorporate recycled content into that film. We've been told that it's very difficult and can't be done, but they told us the same thing when we said we wanted to make our bottles from 100% recycled plastic, so we're just going to rely on our team's expertise and, and push through. We were the first beverage company in North America to build our own recycling facility and produce our own RPET in a closed loop system. And we still are the only beverage company in North America doing so today. Our goal is to be carbon negative as a company and we're pretty much there right now. But global warming's here. We got a few years to try to get this thing reversed. And if we do, our grandkids are gonna have a great planet to live on. If we don't, I really question what we're going to have here in 50 years. We attract people who really do care about the environment. So if you're not into recycling, then this is probably not the place for you. 
We really want to do what's best for the planet. We want to do what's best for our team members and we want to all work together and have fun. We like to see the passion for the environment, for good for you, good for the planet. That's, that's what we look for in people to come and work at Ice River because that's the environment they're going to be working in when they do come. I'm very, very proud to work for Ice River Springs and to be part of the family that operates this business. This company allows me to go to work every day and feel like I'm doing something for the environment, something for people, something for the planet, and driving a better world for my own children in the future.